Hello everyone, welcome to Helpful Solution Tutorials and welcome to our HitFilm Express tutorial. HitFilm Express is a powerful and free video editing and visual effects software that allows you to create stunning videos. In this tutorial, we'll dive into the world of HitFilm Express, exploring its features, tools and capabilities. So whether you're a beginner or an experienced video editor, you'll learn how to import footage, edit videos, add special effects, and export your projects. By the end of this tutorial, you'll have the skills to create impressive videos using HitFilm Express. So let's get started. So as we said, HitFilm Express is known for its versatility in video editing and VFX. It is one-stop solution for all your video creation needs, offering a wide range of creative possibilities. Now let's talk about how to get started with HitFilm. So signing up is a straightforward process. Simply visit the HitFilm website, download the software, and install it on your computer. You don't need to create an account or provide personal information to start using HitFilm Express. It is free to use, making it accessible to everyone. So let's jump into the world of video editing with HitFilm Express. So after downloading the application, you'll be directed here. So this is the dashboard of your projects. So this is our first project, for example, we have here file. When you click on file, you'll be able to add a new project and those are the settings. So you can choose a template, the duration of your project, uh, the size of your video, the height, the frame, the audio, etc. So here we have the overview of the project. So when you start uh, editing your video or your images that you're using in your video, it will be shown right here in this small screen. So for example, here you have the timeline. In this timeline, you can add audios, you can add tracks, videos, etc. photos. So you're gonna be able to edit it right here. So here you can cut, you can trim, and you can add many photos and videos on diff uh, different layers, sorry. Also, when you click on file, you'll be able to open a project, open a recent project, recover projects. If you had a project, then you deleted it. You can save your current project. You can import files, media, image sequence, uh, composite shot, 3D cameras, etc. Project setting, record, uh, you can record voiceover and many other options. And if you click on edit, you'll have many options too. So for example, we have uh, into a project, redo a project, you can slice a project, you can select project. We can cut, copy, pass and duplicate, delete or ripple delete a project. You can pass the attribute, remove attribute or remove effects. Also, when we click on effects, we have many effects. So we have this uh, animation, audio, behavior, blur, channel, uh, color correction. So each one has, or each features has its effects. So uh, for example, now, if we wanna create a project, we go here, for example, click on file and click on new. Then you have to select your projects. So you can add the editor, you can uh, add the rendering. So here you have the template, the duration of the projects. So for example, let's click OK. And just like that, you will be taken to the dashboard of your new projects. So here we have the library. So we have a library for music, sound effects, and here for templates. So now, for example, if you click on import media, when you go up there here, you click on file, then you go and click on import media. You'll be able to upload your videos and photos directly from your device. So now when we click on upload, we go then here, uh, down here, we have library and then media. We click on media. You can also import it directly from here or you can find the videos that you uploaded right here. So what you need to do, you need to scale it down right here to the screen or the video overview where you see the video and then you just add it and it will be added here also in your timeline. So now you can change the size. For example, you click here and you move it like this and then you'll be able to edit it in your timeline. So here we have the video. It is in our timeline. Uh, and if the video has the audio, the audio of the video, it will be shown right here. So you can also separate the video from your audio. So if you want to keep the video and remove audio, you can mute the audio and keep the video and uh, vice versa. If you need the audio, you can just upload it both, then you delete the video. 
So now, when you click on templates, you'll be able to add many templates for your text. So we have banner, clean uh, box line, clean double box, flashy, etc. You choose the one that suits you the best. So for example, let's choose this one. You click on it and click on import. It will be added to your library of it media, but it is for template. So now what you need to do, you click here and you add it here. It will be added here. So now you can choose it the size from here from the screen like this. Now if we play our video, you just click here and you play our video. It will be added directly to your screen. So you can see here the writing or the text and you can edit it if you want. You just go here, click on it and then you click on edit where you can add the text uh, that you want, the size of the text, the colors, etc. Now, if you click on effects, you'll be able to add anima animation, sorry, for example. So, for example, this center wipe, you click on it, then it is a private uh, setting. So, you need the, uh, to upgrade to a paid plan to use it. But as you can see here, you can reveal the length, you can conceal the length, gradient the size, you can change the direction, and many other options like the scale, the position, the rotation. And now going back here to our library, you'll find the template here, the sound effect here, the music here. So if you want to uh, upload music, you have a free music to use. You click, for, for example, on this one, you click on download, it will be download. After downloading the music, you'll be able to add it directly here to your video. Just scroll it from here into here and it will be added down here and you can feel it or hear it sorry on your video when you click on the start and uh, button we also have other options uh, for our video editing so if you click on option here you can change the color you can show the motion path background color so for example if you click on background color you'll be able to choose a, co a color for your background so for example like this one uh, now if we uh, change the size of our video like we click on it and we change it the background color it will be shown directly right here so now we click again on background color and you add the background color click on ok it will be uh, shown here so for now those are the effects or you know the options that you have if you're subscribing to a free plan without paying but of course if you upgrade to a paid plan you'll have many other options so for example if you just click on effects you can see those effects like for animation there are many effects but they are for the upgrade version the paid version so you have to upgrade to another version to use those effects but still you have uh, many options other option you know if you want to create a simple video for your uh, live streaming for your youtube videos i think those uh, features that you have in the free plan are enough for you but if you want to create more professional uh, content you'll have to upgrade to a paid plan so now when we click on upgrade we can check the plans for uh, the platform so they have uh, many plans so they have a free plan they have the creator plan and they have a best value plan thank you so much for watching the video i'll advise you to use the tool see you in the next video